the, sh the shop's been here since 1932. Um, J.P. Morgan lived upstairs. We've had nothing but Wall Street crew here. Neil Costello's barbershop sits directly across from the New York Stock Exchange on Wall Street, where he has had a front row seat to the financial crisis. That's good, you do that every time. I talk to customers that have been in Wall Street for 30 or 40 years. They've never seen an economy like this. Actually, there is one customer who has seen it this bad before. Wall Street. I've worked here since, well, really, summertime, 33 and 34, and from 35 to now. Bob Newberger says the current crisis reminds him of the Depression. During the Depression, people were over-leveraged. That's exactly the same. Oh, only had like four deals blow up in like a week's time. Although haircuts are a necessity, Neil's customers say they're cutting back in other ways. What I'd have to say I'm cutting out is probably taxis and takeout food. We were thinking of rebuilding our house and we kind of slowed down that project because we didn't want to deploy all our available cash into something where you really don't know what the future holds. I eat out less and cook for myself more than I used to, that kind of thing. But, um, uh, no, I still get my hair cuts pretty regularly. They keep coming back to Esquire's for the old-fashioned trim with warm shaving cream. Can I call it more of a man's barbershop? And the cold beer. And if that's not enough to take the edge off, Neil keeps a cabinet full of liquor, just in case. Whiskey's popular. <laughs> Pleasure. Bye. Bye.